Dear brothers and sisters, it's my joy to share with you that after several months of prayer and discussion, our elders have unanimously decided to lead ECC forward to meet as one assembly in a single worship gathering on the Lord's Day mornings starting in July of this year. We strongly believe that the Lord is leading us forward in this direction as the best next step for ECC as we seek to grow deeper and wider in growing disciples from the nations to be gospel ambassadors to the nations for the glory of God. This is a step forward in embracing our calling to be an embassy of the Lord Jesus Christ in Abu Dhabi and we want to move forward together as one. ECC will begin to gather together as one church at one time to worship our triune God together each week. Of course, this is not news to many of you as you've heard at several members meetings now that our elders were praying and thinking about this change. We have also heard positive feedback and encouragements in this direction from several of you already. It's clear to us that for many of our members, this will be a welcome change. For others, you might be wondering why the change, and for yet others, you might feel uncomfortable with this decision right now. But over the next two months, we want to give you many opportunities to learn more, to understand our rationale, and to ask questions. And we hope we will all be unified as we begin gathering together in July. But for now, let me share with you five main reasons for this change in the life of our church. How will gathering together as one grow our discipleship and witness? Why are we as elders leading in this direction? Well, first, we want to grow deeper and wider in our worship. The word church, biblically, comes from the word ecclesia, which means assembly. And the biblical pattern for local churches is for a people who agree to live in covenant relationship together as the body of Christ and gather together regularly under the preaching of God's word and the celebration of Christ's ordinances. We therefore believe that a single assembly together under the word of God is the ideal structure and format for biblical worship as a church. A single gathering ensures that each time we assemble, our entire congregation is visible in its unity and diversity. We would even more clearly display the beauty of every tribe and tongue and nation around the throne of Christ. And we believe that we would provide a clearer display to our non-Christian friends and neighbors in the love and unity of such a diverse people gathering together to worship our Lord Jesus Christ. Deeper relationships in a diverse community is a powerful display of the power of the gospel. Therefore, we want to move ECC in the direction of conforming to this biblical ideal, especially as our attendance can now be accommodated within a single gathering. Remember, when we commit ourselves to the body of Christ, we don't commit simply to a time slot for worship, but to a family with whom we will worship, a family of believers from all nations. Not only do we want to grow deeper and wider in our worship, we also want to grow deeper and wider in relationships. As we have covenanted together as the Lord's people, of utmost importance is our relationships with one another, of bearing one another's burdens and so fulfilling the law of Christ. We've been blessed as a culture of meaningful membership and one another care has grown at ECC over the last several years. We want to see this culture continue to deepen and widen in our church. And we believe that the best way to build and strengthen and nurture relationships is through worshiping together as the body of Christ and through being in direct face-to-face -face contact with one another on a regular basis. Currently, each of our members only sees some of the other members on a regular basis. Sometimes members from one service haven't seen members who attend the other service for several months at a time. We believe that seeing one another regularly and seeing more of our brothers and sisters would encourage us towards more and more family love as a church. We would be able to minister and care for one another more 
before and after services. Engage with more members who are lonely and build more relationships across the church. A single assembly also means more opportunities to connect after the gathering, to extend hospitality to visitors, and to engage with one another over meals. Third, we want to grow our church deeper and wider in discipleship. The Lord has already abundantly blessed ECC with great pathways for equipping adults, teens, and children with the Word of God. However, we want to see ECC grow even further in this aspect of our life together as a church. We want to help our members continually be transformed by the renewing of our minds and equipped for the work of ministry, for the building up of the body of Christ. As we move to a single assembly for worship, we would have greater freedom to expand our Christian education and discipleship pathways on Sunday mornings through expanding our Sunday sessions to multiple tracks and classes to equip people at every level from children to adults. Fourth, we want to grow deeper and wider in our shepherding. Currently, only a few of our elders see the whole congregation each week. That's uh, those of us who are leading in both worship services. We believe that the benefit of a plurality of elders would be greatly multiplied and more deeply realized when all of our elders are present with all of our congregation every week before, during, and after our gathering as a church. A single assembly also increases pastoral capacity to engage in more relationships, make more disciples, and for the elders to more faithfully shepherd the flock that Christ has entrusted to us. And finally, we want to grow deeper and wider in partnership. We believe that moving forward together as one would help us bless other gospel preaching local churches in Abu Dhabi. If we at ECC happen to burst at the seams and have more people than we have space, we are actually creating opportunities for more people to consider joining our sister churches like New Life Church and Grace Church Abu Dhabi. We rejoice in the opportunity to bless other churches that preach the gospel and aid their growth for gospel witness as well. Dear brothers and sisters, please be on the lookout over the next several weeks for more information, for more education, uh, for opportunities to ask questions and to learn more details. And please join us in prayer for the unity and for the spiritual growth of our church family as we enter this new and exciting season, ECC, together as one.